and uh, we're gonna go meet our, our car camping crew at the homie's house. Hopefully we get a good spot for not sleeping at all, so. Hey, primo, quítense de la calle. What's up, y'all? Hey, 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 hey. Camp chat 2024. Hey, let's put this flag on. Are you doing camping this year? Well, no, I'll, I'll be joining you guys a little just, bit. Just on the edge or what? But no, yeah. me and my girl are going to do day parking. Oh, nice. Yeah, I mean, we've always done it. She always likes coming back home and showering. See, that no one veers from the group. I said if we if we get um, separated at a light, I'll, I'll pull to the side it over just, the side. Sure with the caravan together. Yeah. See you tomorrow. <laughs> Why is he up right now? I don't know what the hell Mario's talking about. Get on the, get on the, get on the. Shit. Shit. Saludos por co. Arriba todos los que trabajan. Tempranito. Aquí nos vamos. Bien chido. Get on the, compa. Get on the, get on the, get on the. Saludos, primo. The only way to get through this street, huh? Yeah, see, like, they even barricaded this that way. People don't bust the U-turn. We were gonna pass that. Grass and sin. <laughs> you don't have to say it. You made it, you made it! Camera! Yeah! Car camping pass. 451 in the morning. The conversation got boring. We have uh, two cars left before we get searched. And they are patting you down and checking all all your compartments and ice chests and everything. So make sure you guys don't have any glass. Just follow the rules. Uh, probably a couple of items in the essay. Yeah. Hmm. Bro, I was looking at this ice chest. <laughs> <laughs> she said they was local. <laughs> Yo, <I'm lying. laughs> Y'all had easy hey, stuff. Easy. Yeah. Y'all had easy stuff. I got some circle. I got some circle. I know you can't read. <laughs> I'm gonna wear my high shoes tomorrow. <laughs>
the easiest car it's just like they don't guess okay what you say you guys don't guess there's just like open the big bags open them up and I'm like um we don't have big bags but she's like suitcases I'm like we don't have suitcases so she just can't get out like Casi ¡Ya no. llegamos! ¡Arriba todos los jornaleros! <risa> ¿Qué up, yo? Sí, güey. Eh, gracias, chavos. Se sí, güey, se pasa. This is just gets out of the car for no reason. Triple lavada y una banda que me ya quiere mi la y no está mal porque me seduce como animal. Sube nada ni está. 6 a.m. What time is it? I don't even know. Early, early, early. What's up? 5:30. So now we have all our tents and clothes. Nice stuff. Nice Sturdy? Sturdy. Better make sure it's sturdy as hell. Sturdy as Dwayne Johnson. Gotta put up two sticks. Low smoke break. <laughs> you already did two sticks. So, shout out to Dust Flooring for sponsoring this tent. Dust Racing Tent. A little psychedelic, cool uh, thing. Unos pinches chicharrones. Unas naranjitas. The sun is rising. People are setting up their campsites. I've only slept one hour tonight. And, uh, Gotta come back, gotta be ready by five. I have an interview with Golden Boy. Does you wanna see this weekend? You're most excited right now. You're like, fuck it, I've been looking forward to this one. I've been looking forward to see Bizarra. I mean, he's probably the one of the persons who's from the most south in the Americas coming, you know? Huge producer. It's gonna be, I think, at the Sahara, at the new Sahara. Lana Del Rey. <laughs> no, I think I'm gonna skip Lana. I'm gonna go watch some DJs. I wanna go watch Chris Lake's new group. At Antia, Antia at the Mojave. At the Mojave. I mean, we'll see how that's gonna go. That's gonna go crazy. I mean, I think this weekend has a lot of DJ, EDM, and like, like badass and Latino fun. acts that are 
majority putting them on and you got your few American acts um, but Coachella is an international festival and I mean I think there's 15 Latino groups playing at Coachella this year burritos nah. sandwiches sandwiches de jamón con mayonesa no una ziplo de esas grandes parece masa but it's a tuna. Chicken salad. Chicken, Chicken salad. salad. Shall we in? Got the uncrustable. Wait, some more. 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 This is the fourth decade already? Yeah. Yeah, it's the fourth. Damn, you, 90s, you guys are washed. 2000s, 2010s, 2020s. You guys. Four decades. We survived what? Pandemic, oh, the, swine flu. The swine flu. <laughs> World War Three. Our Indio High School, they shut it down for a week because someone yeah, um, had swine flu. Yeah, we got to go home. It was a rainy day. And then, the, and then the announcer like, hey, everybody, uh, we're going to cancel classes because it's whatever. And as soon as they, they said that, everyone started cheering. <laughs> and I was like, yeah. People freaking ran out oh, of the classes. Yeah. yeah, people were acting like wild monkeys Because there was one case at our school. <laughs> I said you would catch it. <laughs> that was probably blacklisted. I never saw that guy again. <laughs> oh, we survived what up and I'll... Fuck. I don't know. How was that like 2014? Yeah, I still have nightmares. But I'd be lying to myself if I didn't say I want to see John Summit. Even though I've seen him multiple times, I feel like every time he throws down a different set, and I'm, I'm just that, that's my guy. That's La Danza. That's John Summit, baby. How many times have you seen John Summit? Not enough. Um, now I saw him at the Shrine. Uh, saw him in, in Vegas, and I picked up the truck. Um, and then saw him actually at Coachella. Uh, I think two years ago, two or three years ago, he was here. BMO. BMO. BMO oh yeah, yeah, we watched with my BMO together. Goddamn, bro. Super yeah, fan of So like three or four times, yeah. Let's see. Fuck. Beats the Raps, like, definitely up there. Oh, I really want to see Purple Disco Machine if I can. I didn't get to see Purple Disco last time. I really want to. I, feel, I think that Anti Up is going to have one of the best acts of the weekend. If it's everything that Chris Lake says he's going to do with Chris Lorenzo, I'm all for it. Right there, front and center, watching it. I feel like it's gonna be like a George Lucas like film, mixed with crazy ass, uh, crazy ass graphics, man. And if it's supposed to be in an intimate setting, I'm looking forward to that. I think those are like some of the top three or four that I'm looking forward to seeing. OJ, OJ Simpson died. What the fuck? On day zero. Day zero oh, Coachella. Day zero. <laughs> <laughs> day zero Coachella. OJ Simpson just died. Rest in peace. Yeah, man, shout out to the guy that said, if the glove don't fit, you must quit. No, say how you said it earlier. What? What did I say? The, the juice. juice. Oh, yeah, shout out to the juice. Rest in peace. Or pieces. I'm not sure what the situation every death is. Do you guys think uh, over under, uh, did he make it to heaven or hell? <laughs> <laughs> I think he made it to a second trial. I think he's gonna make it to purgatory. Yeah, there's not gonna be any gloves involved in this one. <laughs> 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 that was it. Rest in peace, water. though. Rest in peace to the juice. Yeah, rest rest in, in peace. peace. Juice. Gone too soon. some juice for you. Here, I'm gonna pour some out for the juice. On our way back home, and then we gotta come back by five. It's barely like 9.30 in the morning and it feels like 3 p.m. I'm sunburned. She's sunburned already. <laughs> I'm, uh, I feel sunburned on my hands and my neck, but <sighs> yeah, so every day this weekend is going to get a little bit better. It's not going to be as hot, but yeah, be prepared to walk a ton. I'm too. I'll go right there. But... Still? Day zero still, we went home, uh, recharged, finally got to sleep, we were running no sleep. And we haven't gone to the concert with the boys because I have to meet the Golden Voice filming team at the Big Horse over there on 
and uh, maybe interview some people. They're doing eye stuff. You want to do one? They do tattoos. standing under the Trojan horse here at the Coachella campgrounds water refill station to the right and people are still pulling up we're waiting for the Golden Voice film team we're gonna go interview people can you read your time code real quick Victor 173007 hey great we're good all right ready to roll Hi, my name is Angel. We're here at the Coachella Campgrounds. I'm super excited this year. We have Peso Pluma, Karin Leon, Latin Mafia. We have J Balvin. We have a lot of Latinos and just music from all over the world. Mi nombre es Ángel y estamos aquí en el mejor festival del mundo. Estamos aquí en el campamento de Coachella. Y este año va a haber un montón de Latinos de los mejores artistas del mundo. Peso Pluma, J Balvin, esta Latin Mafia, Karin Leon. Y hoy vamos a hablar con la gente a ver qué artistas vinieron a ver a Coachella y qué esperan de este fin de semana. T Pain, Jay Mora. I'm super excited. And how do you feel about like the Latino representation in the in the festival now? I really like they have a lot of Latino like artists and DJs. So and uh, what artists are you excited to see this weekend? Um, of course the headliners, um, but really feeling Peggy Gao and John Summit. Little house vibes, you know. Yeah. <laughs> Coachella changed over the last few years since you first started coming to now. Like, what are you first time? Uh, where are you guys coming from? San Luis Obispo, so like Central Coast. We okay. Cal Poly Slow, San Luis Obispo. Yeah, okay. And um, what artists are you excited to see this weekend? Mm, so many. Suki Waterhouse. I'm really excited to see Faye Webster. And Lana. also Lana for sure. Peggy Gill. Lil Uzi. <laughs> Lil Yachty. <laughs> uh, I'm excited to see Peso Pluma. That's oh, number one. Sweet. Corridos, Mexican music, you know that. Have you guys heard of Peso Pluma? No. I'll have to check Should it out. Did they play? Like... Right before Lana Del Rey. Okay, yeah, okay so, sweet. So if you go early, you could probably catch them so somewhere tomorrow. Set. Okay. What, your favorite songs of Peso Pluma? El Rubicon. El Rubicon? Yeah. Dicen que soy mamón también que soy culero. Shalgo bien. And then, uh, is this your guys' first time at Coachella? Yeah, first time, first time. Um, I actually uh, will watch videos, you know, because I really wanted to come, and so I, I would watch videos. So I knew when I came here, I knew what to do, and so yeah, it, they helped out a lot watching the videos. So. No, I appreciate it, bro. Thank you. What peso pluma? Quién? Quién es peso pluma? You know peso pluma? No idea. No, no idea. <laughs> you guys know peso pluma? I know peso no, pluma. Sorry. I've been I've been Not on a stage with him actually. Oh yeah. He's on with Carol G in Medellin, Colombia, last December. Oh, that's yeah. awesome. Yeah, I love him. Good show. What a uh, since when do you guys, we'll start with you, when did you get started uh, in the film industry? Ooh, 2003 maybe, when I, no, two, 2000. Well, my whole life, actually. I just went to <laughs> film school in 2000, then graduated and moved, moved to L.A., but it's pretty much my whole life. A meterte en la industria de video. Eh, pues empecé, estudié cine también, eh, y me gradué en el 96. Y luego, pues, pues yo creo que desde el 2003, Empecé eh, haciendo documentales, okay. estuve en la gira de, de las Dixie Chicks, 2003, oh, nice. desde hace mucho y pues ahí, ahí, ahí sigo. Ok. ¿En el festival? Since when is... Oh, sorry, since, uh, since 2004. 2004 I, I, no, wait, 2014, 14. this is ah. my 10th year. Yeah. This guy's a legend. This guy's a legend. I had kind of a weird introduction because in I was an electrician before. Yeah. And it, this kind of started as a hobby. And then, like late '90s, um, kind of started moving in the direction of camera operating and doing lighting and that kind of thing. Just finished doing some interviews for the Coachella live stream. Hopefully, we make the final cut. And then uh, we're back at the campsite with the homies. Man, day zero is being wild, man. We uh, drove in from LA around midnight and uh, hung out in, in Indio for a little bit and. Just rested, got our group together, and uh, 
came in a seven car caravan. As Brian said, it looks like, it's, he's like, not to be mean or anything, but like, or, he was like, it looks and it looked like a funeral procession because we're all driving <laughs> slow with our, with our blinking lights on, you know? And so uh, well, luckily we got in super quick. Uh, luckily we got in super quick. 25 minutes for the line to start opening and people pushing through. And so, man, it was uh, pitch tents at around like, I think, what time was it? I think it was like 5.45. Yeah, we got in, it was like 5.30. We got in 5.30, 5.45, pitch intense by early six. Day zero, well, I guess we got a soldier down. Well, one of our compatriots, he, uh... <laughs> All right, let's go, let's go. He went through a little moment during a game by many Coachella attendees, and so we want to ask Carlos to see how he's feeling, you know? Better worse, days like what? I've had worse days too, but... He's had worse days than today. So what happened today? Uh, so the organizers at Coachella decided to set up a dangerous game. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> well, that's sort of true, but what was played the game? a game. What was, was the game? Uh, what was the game? Capture the flag. We're basically, think of like a football kickoff where just two teams are running at each other at full speed. Collision, head collision happened. Got a cut in my, next to my eye. I get a medical attention, so. Uh, to get medical attention. So be careful, guys. Don't play games at Coachella or else you're going <laughs> to... Especially if you're having a really fun day zero, you know? Yeah. We had a, such a long day zero, right? Ya se dormió el compa, ya se dormió el compa. Está bien dormido. Yeah, day zero, I mean, we're relaxing. We're going about to go check out the entire car camping. Open? Laid it up. Yes, sir. Served up. At Coachella Curry. At Coachella Already Curry. Know. Already know. I just gotta clean this. Cheetahs and popcorn. You think you can see the moon on this? Wow. Uh, so definitely excited to see Steve Angelo. Um, huge EDM fan, house music fan. So um, I want to see Body High by Alesso. Um, super stoked for DJ Snake. Uh, his shows always go off and this is apparently like his last time touring. So uh, super excited for that. Dom Dalla, obviously, John Summit and then everything always them together. So uh, Justice as well. The lineup stacked, like it's crazy. There's so many people on the lineup that I'm super excited to see. People hate on it, but no, it's stacked. They play at a bad time though. Yeah, they do. But I think there's somebody that I'm like.
Watch the fire DJ. I don't know who was on, playing, but she was getting down. End of day zero. Tens of ready for the new Saharatan? <laughs> oh my god, the Saharatan is gonna just blow everyone's minds. I mean, it has to, to some degree. Be better than the previous Sahara, like you have to be bigger and badder. That's so. crazy. <laughs> it's not hard to get into it. It Dude, was have, have you seen this? It's gonna have a circle ball in the center at the top. A circle ball? Have you seen it? No, oh, I'll show you. I got a sneak peek. 